Hey UM, how's it going? We're gonna get started here in just a couple minutes here. Just getting uh, getting everything set up. Welcome to the stream, appreciate you joining and watching. Where you go? How are you this evening? Hey, Louis the Suit, Bonanza Dude. How's it going? How are you guys? We're just setting up and we're gonna get going in a minute or two here. This one should be interesting. We are doing our I-10. Our I-10 rating. One more to go after this. And we are done. There we go. Chat wasn't loading. I'm doing pretty good. How about you? I'm doing great. Hope chat is working for you now. Looks like it is. I'm assuming since you were able to type something. Better good. Better good. I'm doing well. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm a little nervous about this one. Hey, F18, how's it going? I did a practice run on uh, Thursday as I was setting up my uh, iPad integration, which seemed to do well. I'm still having a few issues on swapping back and forth for the stream with my hotkeys, but uh, it's no big deal. I tried a few different uh, variations, but uh, it wasn't working out so good. Let's go ahead and uh, switch over. All right. And there we go. All right. We're going to get everything set up here. Do, 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 do. All right, so let me switch over to my flight plan go. There we go. And we are going to brief this particular exam. So this is going to be a little bit of a sticky wicket. So we are taking off from, and as you can see, I am close to 2-5 uh, Santa Barbara. So we're going to be leaving Santa Barbara on the Float 5 departure. Come on. Oh, now is not the time for my iPad to go crazy. On the Float 5 departure. No, I'm not trying to do... Come on. Wow, is it slow? What the heck? No, I didn't press the edit key. What are you what are you doing to me here? Okay, this is really beginning to pish me out. Come on. Wow. Okay, you know what? I am going to get, just in case this starts giving me troubles, I am going to get uh, either my iPad is going nuts. So I'm going to get my departures and everything all loaded on my other one, just in case I thought I had all the buggies worked out. 
but apparently not. So I'm going to get all my plates open on my other computer. Departure, float 5. Get that open just in case. And then we're going to Santa Maria. Get that airport diagram. Wow, it's just... Alright, let's close that down. Go away. Come back. Flight plan go. Alright, go to binders. Flow 5, I guess. Alright, uh, but just for giggles, just in case this happens mid-flight, I don't want to have to worry about it, so I'm going to put my other, my plates up there. So, Santa Maria, we are going to do the uh, localizer back course from San Marcos. And then I'll go over this with you since I get these plates up in my other. Uh, we're going to go mist, hold it, go to loopy. Then we are going to our alternative airport. Uh, which is going to be San Luis KSBP KSBP San Luis Regional and we're going to do the VOR Alpha into there and get that in there get the airport diagram in there Okay. Hey Sierra, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Alright. So, we are going to depart on the float 5 uh, because I am closest to 25. Hopefully that's what we will get. So we'll depart 25. Uh, so from 25 we're going to be turning left to intercept the 197 radio out of San Marcos. Uh, we will do a procedure turn over flout. Uh, from flout, uh, we're going to cross at the intersection of Gaviota 92 and San Marcos at or above 6,000 feet. So that's all good. So we're good there. Then from San Marcos, we're going to ask for the localizer DME back course alpha from San Marcos, and we will follow that into the mist. The mist uh, mist approach would be at 0.5 DME from the airport. Uh, circling 1100 feet. Alright, so we will request a low approach and the mist over there. So they'll be expecting that. Then from the mist we are going to climb to 2100 feet to Guadalupe and do a couple rounds in the loop at Guadalupe. While we're doing our rounds in the loop of Guadalupe, we're going to call for IFR clearance to go to San Luis. From San Luis, uh, the VOR Alpha, and we're going to request San Luis from Morro Bay. So I need to make sure I make a note there. From M M Q zero Morro Bay. All right, so from there, gonna fly. So hopefully we're gonna get a direct to Morro Bay. From there, we're gonna fly uh, the eighty four radial. No, sorry, the two sixty four radial from Morro Bay outbound. Do a procedure turn and then come back inbound to land full stop 
at San Louis. Alrighty then. Hey, Matthew Dakis. Sorry if I screwed up your name. Thank you. All right, so that is all good. So we got that all done. Let's go back here and let's go ahead and get our avionics on. Switch over to the GTN. Hey, I appreciate everybody stopping by to watch me do my i5, or excuse me, my i10. My i10. All right, so let's go ahead, before we connect to Pilot's Edge, we'll go ahead and... Taz, system test okay. Thank you, Taz. You know, I like her, but sometimes she can be a real biatch. Okay, so flight plan from Santa Barbara to KSMX, KSMX, enter. We're going to be loading the procedure, departure, float 5, and I'm going to assume runway 25, over to San Marcos, load that departure. So that's all good there. Oops. Okay, so we're going to go mist from San Marcos. So we will add the waypoint Moro Bay, MQ0, MQ0. Oops. MQ0, is that right? That's not right. MQ0? It's not a zero. MQ, MQ, MQ0. Next place. Oh, there we go. Otherwise we'd be flying all the way to Germany and this would be a very, very long I-10 rating. Uh, tomorrow Bay, then we're going to add our KSBP. Hey, appreciate the uh, follow, Matthias. Welcome aboard. Uh, KSBP. KSBP. Enter. And we are going to do the... VOR Alpha Approach Vectors for Moro Bay Enter, load that Boom Done And done And then we'll get a circle to land From there Alright So First thing is First we'll just get as much in here as possible, then connect up to Pilot Edge and we'll file. Oops. Boom, boom, boom. Back, flat five. Uh, we want to get up to. Uh, how come I. Oh, that's weird. All right. Okay, my autopilot is not... That does not seem to be responding properly, so that would be a bad day. Let's go ahead and reload that. That would be a very bad day. Where is it? GF dev and that, yes. And let's start that up again.
Come on. All right, got that started. Aha! Buttons are working. All right. Okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. No need to panic. No need to panic. Nobody panic. All right. Uh, okay, so... We need to go up to 6,000 feet for crossing restrictions. And when we leave, we will be turning left to intercept Flout. And that's going to be San Marcos 114.9. 114. 114.9. Make sure we get that identified. EFT bearing. Okay, that's all identified. 104.9, and we want to intercept on the 197 radial. 197 radial. And go back to the airport diagram. Taking off on 25, so that's 256 on the initial heading. Go this way. So runway heading is 256. We got that. And then we will, we'll, once we get up a little, about four or 500 feet, we will start our intercept. For that, so that's all set up. Get out of this stupid unsuspend mode. All right, so that's unsuspended. We're in VLOC mode, so that's all good. Switch back over. See, this is the problem I'm having with my hotkeys to switch scenes. Okay, uh, we are all set up. Let's go ahead and open up pilot edge and connect connect oops I connected as the wrong that's oh, the other way for okay I want to disconnect I connected was the wrong plane All right, we'll push it, then I'll hold short Charlie call for taxi. To Disconnect. And connect. There we go. I got to change airplanes. I did my I-9 in the Phenom, and now we're in the SR-22, so I need to connect with the SR-22. Okay. So now we're connected. SR-22. We are making sure I'm squawking standby now, so we're going to file the Kate, flight plan. Charlie 8, Bravo to Foxtrot to 25 right at Foxtrot, right. XL 445, thank you. So, we are going KSMX, KSMX to No, not KMX. Let me see, I'm already confusing myself. KSBA. KSBA to Santa Maria KSMX. KSMX. And the alternate airport is San Luis KSBP. KSBP. Uh, flight time. How long did it take me in practice? It's a good hour. Let's just say it's an hour. Let's just say it's two hours. It's not going to be two hours. And we'll just say four hours. I don't think it's going to take that long. Now nah, let's just go with one and a half hours. 130. Cruising speed is going to be one. Uh, let's do 160-ish. And 
cruising altitude is going to be 6,000 feet. John Wayne Tower, good evening. And we're, we're going to file uh, left, flout to five, flout five. Cross two zero left and two zero right. We're cleared for takeoff. San Marcos R Z S R Z S. And Tower, good evening. XL four forty five. Come up with two five right. Fox start ready to go. I ten exam, please. So that's all good. Okay, so IFR Santa Barbara KSBP to Santa Maria KSMX diverting to KSBP which would be St. Louis so that's good that's good that's good that's good 166,000 float 5 Santa Maria Tower 611 midfield RZS boom 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 sent flank plan good clear for the option for 30611 all right that is good we're good there okay uh, clearance 132.9. Ground up 55 Charlie. So 132.9. Ground is 121.7. Ground is 121.7. Foxtrot taxi via Charlie 8 Bravo Foxtrot. 121.7. So that's good. Alright. Let's just make sure that we still have the right. XL886, can I still cut a parchment? 886 switching so long. Okay, so we're at X ray now. All right, we're at X-ray. We're good. All right, so let's go ahead and get our clearance. Santa Barbara clearance delivery, Sierra 65 Zulu, looking for IFR clearance to Santa Maria. And this is going to be for our I-10 rating, if possible, please. 065 Zulu Santa Barbara clearance. We can accommodate the I 10 rating and include to the Santa Maria Airport via the Flout 5 departure. San Marcos transition direct. Maintain. Sorry, maintain 3,000. Ex, uh, expect 6,000 one zero minutes after departure. Departure frequency is. 125.4 squawk 5015. Alright, so your 65 Zoo is cleared to Santa Maria via the Flout 5 San Marcos transition. Uh, flight 3000 expects 6 in 10. Uh, departure 125.4 squawking 5015 for 65 Zulu. Sir, 65 Zulu, read back, correct? Alright, so let's get our squawk code in because I always forget to do that. Five zero one five, and for some reason, last time my squat code changed mid-flight. Now I'm pretty sure I didn't press Delta the button, so gonna have to make sure. Okay, so we're clear to three thousand feet first, and we'll go up there. And we heading, so that's all good. Over to ground, 121.7, that's good. Towers, 119.7, we'll get that going. And forgive me if I'm not keeping up with chat, but I'm looking over, nothing's going on. But I appreciate you guys hanging out and watching. All right, so 119.7, so we got that. And Red Strike 242 IFR to Los Angeles with information Victor. We are Red all good there. Los clearance clear to Los Angeles Airport via the Boat 6 departure. Hector transition that is filed. Climb via the SID. Departure frequency is 125.02 squawk 1514. 
Alright. That's clear to Los Angeles via the boat 6 Hector transition. Climb via the SID 12502 and 1514 on the squawk. Red stripe 242. Red stripe 243, back right. Alright, so. Santa Barbara ground, 065 Zulu is ready for taxi. We have X ray. We're located at uh, transient parking northwest by the uh, Delta intersection. Number 65 Zulu, Santa Barbara ground, by 25 taxi via Delta Hotel Julia. 25 Delta Hotel Julia for 65 Zulu. Alright, so Delta Hotel Juliet. Los Angeles clearance. So that's all five good. Alright, let's get uh, parking Cessna brakes are on. Cessna 105 Fort Tango. Let's go ahead and start her up. Okay. Five, four, tango, good engines are going. That is all good. Alright. So we are good, 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 good. Everything's in the green. Everything's good there. Bump, ba -dum, bump, bump. Oh, that's what I forgot. I didn't change my uh, information on here. Let's do that real fast. So departure. Just in case anyone's coming in. KSBA. KSBA. So 86, contact Los Angeles Center 125. Los Angeles Center now, you And you arrival is going to be uh, KSMX, K, oops, KSMX, and then, well, we Los won't. Angeles Center, uh, XL 886, 12.2 climate. That's not going to all fit, but we'll just so go ahead and put that there. And our route. Santa Maria Tower route is going, going to be flip um, five. Or six one one runway three zero clear for the option. Then clear for the option six one one three zero. RZS. The on the five, four, tango, clear to John Wayne Airport Seal Beach uh, Park or Seal Beach uh, Direct. CS. The city said maintain four thousand. MQO. Five point two squawk five four six three. Then KSBP. Cessna 54 Tango, clear to John Wayne, uh, Seal Beach Departure, Seal Beach Direct. Maintain all right. 4,000. Okay, now we got all that going. And uh, on the squawk, it's, uh, I'm sorry, it's 5. Okay, five uh, five let's go ahead and four, four, transponder five, 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 mode C. Five, five. No. Okay, five, five. we're squawking five, normal, that's five, all good. 5015, five, five. Five, that is all good, and we are ready to go. Parking brake off. Uh, let's see, do I have room to go to my right? So eight eighty six count. Probably center one three three point five five. If we end up in the grass, so be it. No, I think center XL four forty five. Looks like I've got room. Zero for two three zero. Good evening. So four forty five, Los Center Center climbing tank level two seven zero. Two seven zero XL four forty five. Los Angeles Center XL eight eighty six sixteen point nine climbing tank level zero. Ooh, a little bit. So All right. Two hundred zero XL eight eighty six. So we got Delta. Oracle Mike. Uh, was that you call? Negative. Uh, who's that call? Uh, Delta fifty five short of two five right ready for departure. Delta fifty five Los Angeles Tower wind two four zero one zero runway two five. Delta two five five clear for the off, Delta fifty five. And then a right on hotel. On team three forty seven after Hector to maintain follow two four zero. Flight level two four zero after Hector Argentina three forty seven. And Juliet is going to be our first intersection. At least the weather looks like it's going to hold up for us. Hey, everybody. Appreciate everyone coming in. If you're just joining us, we're starting our I-10 rating. Las Vegas ground. So you didn't miss much. Taxi, IFR with Victor. Just all the boring setup stuff. Atlantic Aviation. 
Looks like there's quite a few people out here. I don't know if they're real or if they're uh, drones, but right taxi via Hotel Foxtrot. hopefully they won't get in one the way. Right. Hotel Foxtrot, Red Strike 242. And we're coming up on Juliet. Los Angeles Tower, Cessna 1954 Tango at Landmark Aviation with the weather, ready to taxi. Oh, Julia, where's the whole short line? It's the 1954 oh, there Tango it is. Los Angeles Ground, runway 25 left, taxi to Alpha Foxtrot. 25 left, Alpha Foxtrot, 54 Tango. All right. Contact Porch. Going to Porch, Joseph. Hey, Disgrace. Thanks. Uh, I gotta tell you, I watched your video on the i10. It's gonna, it, it was a lot better than this is about to be. So I gotta tell you that that was, that was an awesome. Uh, that was an awesome. I watched all two hours of it, so it was great. All right, uh, we're going over to tower one one nine point seven. All right, go ahead, departure. Don't switch. And we're gonna get uh, departure in the box one two five point four. One two five point. Good evening, XL 639. Okay, we got that. Alright, so we're good there. Let's go ahead and bring flight 5 up. And it's going to be a left turn. Uh, 197, we've got that. We're on VLOC, so that's good. Uh, San Marcos is identified, and we are good to call. Flying 284 at 280. Okay, XL 639, let me clarify my question. Um, are you navigating to something or are you... You think I can do better? <laughs> you did it all with VORs and hand flying. I'm doing Not this with three a combination of uh, GPS uh, and, and a little bit of VORs when I can do it fast enough. Yeah, we lost an engine. Yours, to yours was way, and, way uh, better. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, Delta 55, uh, out of parts, your contact, uh, uh, <coughs> excuse zero, me, eight, zero, I should have brought some, and, uh, some agua to 4, drink, I got nothing to drink in here, maybe this, uh, my stewardess will come in and, uh, I left zero eight zero at 4,000 and we'll get back with you, uh, once we work through this, Delta 55. Los Angeles Center, Argentina, 347, flight level 240. <sighs> Let him respond. No? Call it, say again. Excuse me. Argentina 347, flight level 240. Argentina 347, Los Angeles Center, cross Donna, at maintain 13,000, Ontario altimeter 2978. 13,000 at Donna 2978, Argentina 347. John Wayne, clearance, Beechcraft. Oh, oh my sweet. goodness. Hi, FR to Avalon. Hey, MCO spotting. Welcome aboard. Welcome aboard, everybody. I just need to be able to jump in real fast. Santa Barbara Tower, Sierra 65 Zoo is ready to go holding short uh, 2 5 at Julia, IFR. Number six one one taxi via Alpha the ramp. Thank taxi you. Alpha the ramp six one one. Las Vegas Tower, red stripe two forty two, uh, one nine right, at Fox Trot, ready to go. Red stripe two forty two, Las Vegas Tower, runway one nine right, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, one nine right, red stripe two forty two. And Santa Barbara Tower, zero six five Zoo is ready to go, Juliet uh, two five.
do 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 And who's calling John Wayne for clearance? Uh, that was uh, Beechcraft 64 X ray uh, clearance to Avalon IFR for my I 7 exam. Number 64 X ray John Wayne clearance so we can accommodate the I 7, clear to the Catalina Airport as filed after departure, flooding 175. Maintain, re sorry, red vectors Victor 21. Then as filed, maintain 5. Oh, uh, I don't want to be a pest, but I don't know if you heard me or not. Two squawk 7226. Clear to Avalon, our Catalina, fly heading 175, vectors to Victor 21, then is filed 5,000 feet, 127.2, departure and squawk 7226, 64 X-ray. Number 64 X-ray, read back, correct? Los Angeles Tower, Cessna 1954 Tango, 25 left, Fox Rock, uh, ready to go, IFR. Number 1954 Tango, LA Tower, runway 25 left, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, 25 left, 54 Tango. And Senate Barber Tower, uh, 65 Zeus, holding short 25 at Julia, ready to go off IR, IFR. Number 65 Zulu, Santa Barber Tower, Roma 25, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, 2565 Zulu, thanks. All right, now we can go. Maybe he was having some. Traffic. Traffic, come on. Seriously? All right, let's go. I think it's clear in Excel 447 instruments to Los Angeles. XL 447, Vegas clearance, Clara, Los Angeles Airport, Bo 6 departure, Hector transition, then is filed. Climb via the SID, departure frequency is 125.02, squawk 6550. Alright, so let's get some positive rate. We're good there. We'll start our left turn. Okay, clear to Los Angeles. Bo 6 Hector is filed. Climb via the SID, 12502, 6550, XL 447. Remember 54 Tango, contact departure. Departure, 54 Tango. Start our turn to intercept. XL 447, read back, correct? Hey, Haas, I appreciate uh, the follow. Thank you much. Number 65 Zulu, contact departure. Over to departure, 65 Zulu, see ya. Departure 125.4. 125.4, that's good. So 86 cross mice and I maintain follow 240. Departure series 65 is with you passing 1300 for 3000. Uh, everybody be advised, I just had about four people just checking at the same time. We get through, through everybody one by one, just stand by. Our team 347 after homeland uh, cross spreads at maintain. 8,000 at uh, 100. Alright, so we've got the uh, we've got the VORs coming in. So I'll switch Century over. Century 4, Echo Mike, 5 miles from Snake, fighting 170, maintain 3,000 until steps from localized clear islands from way 20 right approach. Delta 55, still kind of approach. Altimeter 2980. So right. uh, one nine five four tango so got departure radar contact. Switch over to Zero six five Zulu, Santa Barbara departure radar contact, comment maintain six thousand. Up to six thousand for six five Zulu. Alright. So six thirty nine, contact Los Angeles Center, one two four point eight five. Up to six thousand feet we go. And we are on the 197, capturing that, no problem. So 886, say heading. 
once we get established on that. So 886, thank you. Report leaving. We will switch over to heading mode and then GPS. So 4 .5, lighting zero, three, zero. Aircraft call, say again. Delta 55, turn right heading, uh, turn left heading 350. All right. Other aircraft call, say again. We're over to GPS mode, so that is good. Roger Drive 242, Las Vegas Departure, Radar Contact, I maintain. Hey, Lumber uh, Hacks, how's it going? Zero unrestricted. Spotify, hey, how are you? It's quite a setup you got, but thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And we are on the flat five departure right now, so we'll do a procedure turn at flat five, and that's what the plate looks like. So 639 Los Angeles Center, cross caddy at maintain. And as long as we cross, as long as we cross the intercept of Gaviota and San Marcos at 6,000, we will be good. So we're in GPS mode, so that's good. And we will thank you. do a turn, a little Yui, as soon as we cross flout. So 445, turn right 5 degree. So that's the 195, 4 Tango SoCal approach, uh, altimeter 2980. So, Chair of Oracle, Mike, contact John Wintar 126.8 at 11. That's all good, that's all good, that's good. Alright. So, we should start turning in a bit here. So, 430, uh, 536 uh, Los Angeles Center. Uh, you're saying you're unable, caddy at uh, 12000? So 536, I maintain 12,000. All right. So we are turning back. XL 536, reaching 12,000, reduce speed to 250. Back around. And we're almost at 6,000, so, so we are good there. 126.35. As long as we get to 6,000 by Gaviota. Excel 445, Center maintain flight level 240, contact Los Angeles Center 126.35. So we're turning nice there. Hey, appreciate so the follow, Lumber Hacks. Thank you, welcome aboard. 230, then cross car and maintain 13,000, Las Vegas, altimeter 2959. Hey, welcome aboard, MCO Spotting. Thank you very much, appreciate the follow. So 445 Los Angeles Center, good evening. Uh, turn right 30 degrees for intro. Okay, once we get closer to uh Let's drive 242 contact Los Angeles Center six. San Marcos. Hey armchair, how's it going? It's going good, it's going good. Is that a homemade panel? It is. If you uh if you go on to my information. And follow my Facebook page, you will be able to see uh, a few pictures before and after how I built it and stuff. So it's all, it's all homemade there. Yeah. Uh, approach request is going to be the uh, VO, uh, localizer backhorse alpha for runway 30, and I will go get the weather right now. Sir, 65 Zulu Cross, San, uh, San Marcos at 6,000 clear localized DME back course alpha approach and advise the weather. Roger, Cross, uh, 6,000 approved for the localized DME back course alpha approach, 65 Zulu. All right, let's get the San Marcos weather. KSMX. Uh, KSMX. Maintain 3,500 until established from the approach. Boom. Zero approach and use departing runway three zero. Read back on runway assignment and hold short instructions. Advise on initial contact you have golf. Santa Maria. Okay, golf. Fourteen three forty seven contact. So got approach one two seven point two. All right. So we've got golf. So four fifty five to maintain level two one zero. 
Restaurant 242 Los Angeles Center, good evening. Climbing Tank Level 220. Going a little too Delta fast. 639 Contact Las Vegas Approach 125.02. And departure zero six five Zulu has information Gulf. XL eight eighty six uh, best forward speed uh, until uh, reducing for clock. XL eight eighty six best forward speed until reduction for clock. Pressure at two forty two. I didn't get. It. I didn't hear a read back for you. I think you got stepped on. Say again. Okay, so crossing. I don't know if he heard my uh, my golf, but I'll I'll give it to him a little bit. All right. Our team three forty seven. So Cal approach. So let's go ahead and brief the back end. course here. Uh, descend and maintain six thousand back dial. Let's run two zero right approach. All right. So the localizer back course is going to look something like this. Uh, I am going to cross San Marcos Confirm at 6,000, 6, uh, 108.9, so we can get that in there now. Uh, localizer 108.9. So 536, uh, reduce speed by 20 knots and continue to descent. And we're not receiving yet, which uh, I'm not too surprised. We're still quite a ways traffic, away. Flight, uh, flight level one and then the course is going to be three zero zero one oh eight point nine one oh eight point nine on the nav. Alright, so once we uh expect once we get that in, left, uh, and expect to join the local we will switch over to the back course uh, nav. All right, so we're at 6,000 feet. Speed is good. Right approach. The uh, altimeter 2979. Yeah, I was watching. Uh, I actually caught a little bit of the uh, a little bit of the air show. I saw Peter, um, which was quite amazing. I uh, I had never. I don't know what he was flying. I don't know if that was a uh, one of those Harrier jets. But I mean, he did. Hey, reptile, reptile Rick, welcome aboard. I don't know. Peter did something awesome. He. He did a vertical straight up and then the tail down until he was pretty much hovering over the ground. And then turned and flew off. It was awesome. It was very, very cool. So 445 quit direct Kalar. So 445, I get you lower shortly. So 536 contact Las Vegas approach 125.02. So 639 flighting 280 doing the wrong way 25 left localizer to maintain 7000. All right, Santa Maria Tower is going to be 118.3. So Eleven o'clock, five miles opposite direction. A uh, Phenom jet, flight level one hundred zero. So four forty-five, report passing that traffic. So five thirty-six, Las Vegas approach. Altimeter two nine or uh, eight zero, flighting three six zero vector visual approach runway two five left. And departure of the six five zero. I'm not sure if you heard me. But we've got golf and we're crossing uh, San Marcos. So five thirty six reduce speed to one eight zero. So four forty five to maintain one three thousand. Okay, let's go ahead and load the approach. Yep, we heard it. XL eighty six contact Las Vegas approach one two five point zero two. 
Restaurant 242, clear direct actor, climb attain level 220. Scout 518, Sierra Papa, Big Fit Pro, Big Fit, let's submit a 29061. And uh, Scout 8, Sierra Papa, I'm a little busy, I'm switching to tower, contact tower 918.1, we'll see. Argentina 347, vector through the localizer uh, for uh, delay. Vector through the localizer for delay. XL 886, Las Vegas approach, altimeter 2959F. Uh, clear direct IPUMI, cross IPUMI at 11000 and descend via the arrival. Oh, man, that was, got a little bit off course there for a second. Contact Las Vegas approach, 125.02. All right. So. Tango departure, 6727, Tango, Tango, 1700, climbing 3000. So 536, turn left, heading 240, oh. join the runway 25 left, localized. So at Mado, so we can go down to 4,600 feet. XL 536, Las Vegas. So 536, turn, turn left now, heading 240. Send maintain 5,000, join the runway 25, left localized. XL 639, send maintain 5,000, airport 20, uh, 12 o'clock, 18 miles, point of sight. Same about departure 0727 Tango Tango 2700 for 3000. 0727 Tango Tango Santa Barbara departure radar contact the device frequency is a little bit different. All right. So you have to just uh, be a little bit more patient there. Uh, climb maintain uh, 6000. 6007 Tango Tango, sorry about that. Not a problem, it's okay. All right, so once so, we cross uh, Mado. 45, Las Vegas approach. The Las Vegas altimeter uh, 2959.360, reduce speed to 210. XL 536, you'll pick it up, uh, turn right, to, uh, turn left 10 degrees, it'll, it'll come in there. So 639, clear vision approach, runway 25 left. Argentina 347, turn right, heading 010, descend and maintain 3000. Okay. Clear seven, tango, tango, clear direct, Yaviota, resume all navigation, traffic. Coax is 17. And, uh, Opposite direction altitude in case 5,500, type unknown. All right, when we get to Direct Coax 14, I'm going to start uh, going down. Got a little off coast for a second. So 445, so maintain 1,000. We're better, we're better. So 86 airspeed. Okay. So we're on so that. I'm going to go to heading mode. Since we're established on that, so 445. Let's try uh, 287. You got about a 40 heading mode. Uh, weather thing. I'm gonna switch over to V lock, and we've got uh, that's good. So 886. And we're gonna intercept at 300 zero seven zero on the back course. Okay, so we're crossing Mado now. At 14 DME. Okay, so we can go down to 4,600. So 447. I'll speak to departure radar contact. So 886. 
So 86 fighting, zero, 080, zero, should maintain 8,000. And Santa Maria Tower is going to be 118.3. Argentina 347, you still at 100 uh, knots? Delta 55. All right. Uh, Red right contact, turn left heading uh, zero, 090 zero, back to Corral, that's 425 left road. All right, so we cross Cokes at 4600. So 445, flight heading zero, 090, zero, is going to maintain 8000. So 536, you picking up the local as yet? So 639 contact Las Vegas Tower 199.9. So 536. If you don't have it, then uh, by the Las Vegas uh, one nine or DME, let me know. Thank. You. All right. So 445, uh, uh, did I already get you down to 8? Thank you. XL 447 contact, Los Angeles Center 126.35. So in 7 miles, we're going to be at Cokes. 347, 5 miles from Snake, turn right heading 170, maintain 3000 until established from localized, because uh, that's from way 20 right approach. Scott 5 4 Tango, say airspeed. Scott 5 4 Tango, Roger, maintain 4000 until advised. That's for traffic. Alright, we're at 4600, so we're good. Zero 6 5 Zulu, contact San Maria Tower 118.3 CA. Over Tower 118.3 CA. Santa Maria Tower, Sierra 65 Zulu is on the localizer DME back course Alpha, and we are going to be going missed. Number 65 Zulu, Santa Maria Tower, wind 320 at 10, runway 30 cleared, low approach, report your missed. Clear for the low approach, we'll report our missed 65 Zulu. Okay. We're cleared alpha five, sir. So localizer should be coming so, in in uh, a second here. Six thirty nine on Alpha Five cross from my two five right. Join Charlie to the ramp. Remain this frequency. All right, clear to cross the right side here at Alpha Five. Charlie to the ramp. Stay with you. XL six thirty nine. Thanks. And this is going to be fun because it's the back course. So everything's reversed. All right, we should start picking up the signal. Cokes in 2.5 miles. And then we're going to head down to 3,000 feet. Uh, holding short, one nine left, or I'm sorry, two zero left at Kilo. Number six, four, Echo Mike, John Wayne Tower, one two zero left at Kilo, clear for takeoff. Two zero left at Kilo, clear for takeoff, six, four, Echo Mike, thanks. Alright, so our localizer's coming in. Going back course. V lock mode, that's all good. That coke start heading down to 3,000 feet, so we should start making a right turn here in a second. Tower, good evening. That's 536, visual 25 left. And if we don't, we're XL in trouble. 536, Las Vegas Tower, runway 25 left, clear to land. 25 left, clear to land, XL 536. And we are turning right, so that's all good. Albeit slow, let's go down to 3,000 feet. And we're turning good there. So that's all good. 
Uh, then from Camco, we'll go down to 1720. Number four, Echo Mike, radar contact, say altitude. 600 climbing, 1500, four Echo Mike. Number four, Echo Mike, Roger, contact, departure, good day. Four Echo Mike, see ya. Okay, so that's all good. Number eight, Sierra Papa, taxi to the ramp, have a good day. Okay, taxi to the ramp, thanks a lot, eight, Sierra Papa. Start slowing down. So everything's good so far. Hey everybody, how's it going? John Wayne Tower, good evening, Argentina 347. We are on our first leg of our I-10, which is the uh, DME back course uh, Alpha into Santa Maria. And then we're gonna go mist at uh, half DME at 1100 which is the circling altitude and that would be at the uh, man you're almost kissing the airport right there okay so we're crossing Camco Las Vegas Tower good evening XL 886 joining Camco we can go down to 1720 Las Vegas Tower 5 and Trail coming to Boeing 737 on my 25 left clear line number 225 left XL886 Let's get some get our flaps in. So at Pater, we can go down to eleven hundred. Pretty steep approach here. Let's go down a little faster. So there's seventeen hundred. Vegas Tower XL four forty five. Good evenings on the left base uh, number three two five left. XL 445, Vegas Tower 4 and Trail, come to Boeing 737, runway 25 left, Clitland. Clitland 25 left, XL 445. And we're at 1700, and at Pater, cross Pater, go down to 1100. Let's go down to 1100. And at the missed approach point, we're going to go balls to the wall. All right. So we are at the missed approach point. Go there, GPS, boom, 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 everything's good, up to 2100, up, power, and Santa Maria Tower, Series 65, Zulu is going missed. XL 538, Alpha 5, cross 25 right, uh, Charlie to the ramp. Cross 25 right, Alpha 5, Charlie to the ramp, XL 536. Number 65, Zulu, Roger, contact, Santa Barbara, uh, approach 25.4, sale. Santa Barbara approach, 6 by zero. And Santa Barbara approach, Sir 65 Zulu's just gone missed at Santa Maria. We'll be going into the hold and we'll advise. Uh, number 65 Zulu, Santa Barbara approach, expect further clearance, uh, 0320, zero, zero, time now 025, zero, zero, 01 
Uh, Roger, we'll expect further clearance. Six five Zulu. Somebody else called in there and said something. Say again. Okay. First six working my contact uh, Long Beach Tower one one nine point four six. So we are going to enter the hold. Delta fifty five at Lima contact Tower one two zero point nine five. Everything's good there. Need to climb out. Yeah. <laughs> I uh, I, st I changed my altitude bug and forgot to hit the vert speed, so that was my bad. But I'll hit the hold at 2100, so we're good there. We'll do a lap or two in the hold. Uh, then we are going to request uh, the. VOR Alpha into San Luis Obispo from Morro Bay. Okay, so we're starting our right turn. Boom. Starting our right turn for the hold. So that's good. You can tell them after you establish the safe climb. Ah. Uh, I was trying to do too many things at one time and I wasn't sure what came first, the chicken or the egg. But I do remember, was it aviate, then communicate? Navigate, aviate, communicate? Something like that. I don't remember what came first, but I know you gotta, you gotta do stuff in the, in the, in the airplane before you talk to somebody. So. Aviate, navigate, communicate, or navigate, aviate, communicate. I think. Something like that. Ah, we're going too fast, too fast. Let's slow down. All right, so we're starting our turn. Okay, so now is a good time to get our flight plan at a waypoint KSBP KSBP enter then insert before oops not insert after cancel insert before MQO MQO for Morrill Bay and then KSBP load procedure approach is going to be the VOR alpha vectors from Morrow Bay and I can't activate that approach yet that would be bad so I'm not going to do that yet all right once I get over Morrow Bay then I will activate you're doing a great job so far. Just a uh, just a, something to note here: the angle that you're returning back to the final course there is uh, there's nothing wrong with it. It keeps you in the protected airspace, but it's very steep there. You don't have to be as as steep as you are. That way, you uh, don't risk overshooting it there. Okay. Yeah, Thirty degree offset should be sufficient. You got fly out a minute. Turn Aviate, back, navigate, so communicate. There you go. Acronym: Fly the damn airplane. <laughs> also known as fly the damn airplane. <laughs> oh, you got that right. All right, we're gonna. Uh, is there somebody else in the hold with us? That's what it appears to be. And there's somebody behind us. All right. I don't know if I call and request uh, request to leave the hold and divert to San Luis via Morro Bay. Air six five Zulu, climb in the hold, maintain four thousand. Climb in the hold, maintain four thousand six five Zulu. All right. So he's gonna. So seven tango tango fly heading three three zero. Send and maintain 
3,000 back there. He's uh, going to approach from a 290. He's going to shoot me so direct Morrow Bay. I'm not even going to, I don't even think I'm going to have to request it. Let's see what happens. He'll have me leave the, uh, leave the hold. So 447, Los Angeles Center, across uh, Graham at me, take all the 180. So 447 approved as requested. So 447, um, when you're around it, you clear direct ramp. All right, we're probably going to have to do one more lap. Uh, I might get up to 4,000. Scout 5, 4, Tango at Lemon, contact tower 119 point, I'm sorry, 120 point, uh, 126 point 8. We're getting a little too slow, but we'll pick up some speed here. we got 500 to go. All right, so I'm almost at 4,000. Hopefully he'll give me direct more okay. obey. Or do I request it? Sirius 7 Tango Tango has got seen loose in sight. Sirius 7 Tango Tango, clear visual approach, rolling 2 9 Clear visual 2 9 7 Tango Tango. And departure Sirius is level 4000, would like to depart the hold for the full VOR Alpha approach into San Luis via Morro Bay, please. Zero six five Zulu cleared uh, to San Luis Airport via direct Morro Bay direct maintain four thousand. Clear San Luis uh, Airport uh, via Morro Bay direct Morro Bay six five Zulu. Okay, so we are going to have to go direct Morro Bay now. Yeah, it's going to turn us around a bit. Maintain 4,000. All right, so we will... Hey, appreciate the uh, follow, Evil Delirious. Thank you very much. Welcome aboard. Okay, so we're at 4,000. We are heading direct Moro Bay as soon as I get on... And uh, level two direct. Sure, seven Tango Tango, contact San Luis Tower, one two one point zero. Morro Bay. Over to San Luis Tower, sir, seven Tango Tango, sir. I should have requested the, uh, to leave the hold a little sooner so we didn't have to do this little, this little loop. Sir, six five, so you direct, you should be direct Morro Bay, where you heading? Uh, that is affirmative, I am turning to go direct Morro Bay as we speak. Okay, good. Uh, just keep it, keep it coming back to the right, uh, couple, another mile to the left, and I have to tell you. Yep, no worries. Zero six five Zulu, pick up the weather for uh, San Luis. Advise when you have that. We'll advise with the weather six five Zulu. So four. Ooh, that was not good. I mean, I left the hole a little. Uh, I'm going direct Morro Bay now. I guess I should have turned a little steeper. Okay. Uh, KSBP. KSBP. One zero five hundred scatter temperature one seven two point one three altimeter two nine or eight one visual approach runway two 
So 447 contact, so call first 132.37. Rare strap 242, contact, so call approach 124.9. Okay. Uniform. Santa Maria departure, Sierra 65 Zulu has information in uniform for San Luis. 65 Zulu, Roger, say intentions. Uh, 65 Zulu would like to get the full VOR Alpha approach for San Luis uh, via Morro Bay. 65 Zulu across Morro Bay, VOR at 4000, for VOR Alpha approach, circle letter on my 29er. Uh, across uh, Morro Bay at 4000, clear for the VOR Alpha approach, uh, circle 29er approach, or circle 29er, 65 Zulu. Okay. XL 447, so Calpers, thanks for Bravo to send via the River 2 arrival after. Uh, Alright, so let's go on to 320 on my heading. Three, two, zero on the heading. That's good. Press type 242. And we so are Calpers. going to. Activate my approach. Back, flight plan, down, 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 San Louis, boom, load procedure, VOR Alpha. Vectors, Morro Bay, activate, yes, back, lay plan. Okay. All right, so that's all good. Let's go ahead and get up that bad boy. Uh, boom. No, I don't want that. I don't want to delete. Don't. No. Stop. 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 Seriously? Okay, now it's messing up again. All right. It doesn't want to cooperate, but that's okay. We will just get it back up here. Who almost blew that one. On. I should have turned a little bit sooner. Uh, VOR Alpha. All right. There we are. Oh, that wasn't pretty. I did not leave the approach soon enough. I should have requested to leave the uh, hold earlier, and that would have put me closer on track to cross Morro Bay. But hey, Forrest, how's it going? You are watching. You are watching uh, the I-10 for pilots exam or I-10 exam from Pilots Edge. Okay, so let's get the Morro Bay is 112.4. Let's get that in there and identified which it is. In GPS mode, so that's good. Uh, 84 degrees. We're going to be turning. We're going to be turning 264 degrees in a little bit here. And then we're going to do a procedure turn. OK. 
Okay, so we're going to head outbound on the 264 from Morro Bay, which all looks good. Right, 242, contact LA Tower 120.95. Good night. Uh, let's get uh, the tower 124.0. So that will probably be our next call. Uh, tower, Santa Barbara Tower. Why do I have 127.72? Oh, that's approach. Oh, well, let's see. They might switch me over. Maybe not. We'll see. If they switch us over to Santa Barbara approach at 127.72, and that'll be one thing. All right. So Okay, so we are outbound. We've already been cleared for the approach, so I can head down to 3,500 feet. On this turn. And we're doing a little procedure turn. And then I'm going to call uh, inbound to Morrow Bay because uh, we got to cross Morrow Bay at 2800. And that's going to be 84 degrees. So as soon as we get. XL447 contact SoCal approach 124. I'm going to go back to VLOC mode. Let me slow down a bit here. How's everybody doing today? I hope everyone is doing well. We are inbound for San Luis, finishing our procedure turn. Hotel, SoCal Bridge, on request, am I? We're down to 3,500 feet. That's good. Once we cross Morro Bay at, we'll finish this turn and then cross Morro Bay at 2,800 feet. So 447, SoCal approach, LA altimeter 2980, say altitude. So 447, runner. Okay, so. 480, hotels cleared along Beach Airport as filed. Let's go ahead and get down to 2800 feet. Point six, squawk 3635, hold for release. And we will go into VLOC mode. And get onto the localizer. King Air 480 Hotel, reback is correct. How much longer will you need for departure? King Air 80 Hotel, contact SoCal Approach on 119.6, short of the runway number one. For your for uh, your release. And suddenly we approach zero six five zoo. This finished procedure turn inbound to Morro Bay. Roger. Okay, so we're not going to get switched over. We're going to switch it over to tower 124.0, so that's good. 
All right, so crossing Morro Bay. We've already crossed. I uh, know we haven't crossed. We're gonna go direct Morro Bay. Sir six five Zulu contact San Luis Tower one two four point zero. One two four point zero for six five zero. Thanks. Two forty two is clearing two five left at Alpha Seven parking landmark. Red stripe, or, yeah, red stripe 242, uh, taxi via Alpha to the ramp, remain this frequency, good day. Alpha to the ramp with you, red stripe 242, see ya. See ya. St. Louis Tower, six, Sierra 65 Zoo is crossing over Morro Bay, we're on the VOR Alpha, circle 29 approach. Sierra 65 Zulu, St. Louis Tower, circle south of the field, runway 29, I report your circle. Circle south of the field will report circle 65 Zulu. Alright, so we've got the plane here. So we've got the airport. So we're going to head down to 2800. Which you're at. So Synox. We can go down and hit that at 17. So we'll do the rest of this manually here. Uh, cleared to the John Wayne Airport via the McCarran for departure. Hector transition then has filed. Climb via the SID. Departure frequency is 125.02. Squawk. Synox 1700. Uh, five, three, five, five. Climb via the uh, McCarran 4 to Hector. Get a notch of flaps. Accelerate 89. Read back, correct? All right. Woo. The next 1700. All right, so we're going to head down to 1100. Just right here. And Sierra 65 Zulu is left downwind for 2 Niner. Number 65 Zulu, runway 2 Niner, clear to land. 2 Niner, clear to land for 65 Zulu. Okay. So this is where things get interesting because I cannot. Okay, full flaps. Five hundred. Five hundred. We'll go a little bit farther yeah. out. Hey, appreciate the board, kiss ass. Kissa, eighty five, sorry. <laughs> All right. So looks like we're far enough we can start our base. Woo! What happened there? All right, let's start our base. Sun just tower XL 447, about 10 DME ILS 25 left. XL 447, LA tower on my 25 left, clear to land. 25 left, clear to land, XL 447. Don't say. Don't say. Burbank. Two at a time, I got 625 Sierra Pop, San Bernardino Tower, runway 24, clear for takeoff, on course is approved. Clear for takeoff, right. uh, on course, TC Papa. That wasn't that bad. Remember 7593 Sierra, clearance on request, standby. Alright. Big Star XL 783 coming up on 25 right. We do have fleet. Oh, that wasn't bad. 
Excel 783, Las Vegas Tower, runway 1 on our left, clear for takeoff. 1 on our left, clear for takeoff, Excel 783. Number 7593 Sierra, clear to the Burbank Airport via the runway 24 departure procedure to Paradise, then as filed. Maintain 5,000, expect 6,000, 1 zero minutes after departure. Departure frequency is on 134 point, crash 135.4, squawk 3747. <sighs> boy, we needed the entire runway for that bad boy. That was not pretty, but down. Departure on 35.4, in the box, 7593 Sierra. Number 93 Sierra, read back, correct? All right. And San Luis Tower 65 Zulu is cleared of the runway, looking for taxi. Number 65 Zulu, taxi via Alpha to the ramp. You passed your I-10. Good job. Alpha to the ramp. Thank you for the pass. I appreciate it. See ya. See ya. All right. Holy moly. Woo! Alpha to the ramp. Damn! I almost failed that bad boy. Should have called for a release on that hold a little bit sooner so I didn't have to make that squirrely turn to go direct more obey, and that's what threw me off. Lesson also learned. Okay, Lesson right learned. Thanks, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Now the uh, I-11 is coming up. Not doing that tonight. I think it's time for a cocktail. Definitely time for a cocktail. Alright, so where do we want to go here? Uh, oh, these hangers look pretty good. Join these hangers. Where's my car? Where's my car? What is that, Pinto? Who drives a Pinto? Is there any place for me to park right here? Thanks, everybody. Sorry, I have not been able to catch up with chat as I was a bit busy. Uh, let's take our next left and find a parking spot here. That was a tad busy. I'll catch up on uh, chat in a second. 40 people now. Holy moly. Did, what, did a bus just get out or something? You guys missed all the action. Las Vegas Ground, good evening, XL 294, spot 4, information, uh, Lima, ready for taxi. Alright, this looks like XL a good spot. XL 294, Las Vegas Ground, runway 1 on our left, taxi via Charlie Golf and Delta. 1 on our left, Charlie Golf, Delta, XL 294. This looks it's like a XL good 45, spot. Spot 5, Lima, taxi, we can take 2 5, right? We'll XL park right in front of this guy. Las Vegas Ground, runway 1 on our left, taxi via Charlie Golf and Delta. Okay, Charlie Golf, right. Delta, 1 on our left, XL 45. All right. On Charlie, Shut the down <laughs> the engines. Hey, Armchair Four Aviator, appreciate the uh, follow. Thank you very much. All right. Uh, hey, Brian, great job. A bunch of us are watching. Can you give a big hi to Tom and Jenny? We're all watching. Hello, Tom and Jenny. Charlie to the right. Uh, thanks for watching. Right at Mike you saw it. Showtime so XTX. Okay. Do I know you? We were impressed. We need a shout out to Tom and Jenny. Shout out to Tom so and Jenny. Absolutely. And and don't be impressed. Uh, so if you want to be impressed, right then uh, go thanks. back and look up Disgraced Pilot and how he did the I-10. At least he did it with no GPS. Um, and I only did it with partial GPS and partial VORs. So, you know, they don't believe me this is live. It is live. They don't believe you? I can turn around and say hi. Here, do you want me to... Uh, San Bernardino Grounds. Uh, Tom and Jan... Nine or three, Sierra. Jenny. There. Ground, right, two, four, taxi via Alpha. Tom and Jenny. Tom and Jenny. There. Proof of life. Right there. It's better than a newspaper. Proof of life. 
It's live. Hello, Tom and Jenny. Excel forty. Nah, nah, this was better than my. It was not. Are you? You are just. And and you really want to take me up and let me fly when we, if and when we meet up at F seventy. It's not personal. I I don't know. I don't take it personally. Don't worry. Thanks. Boy, oh boy, that was something else. All right. Well, let's uh, go ahead and squawk standby since we're shut down, and let's go ahead and disconnect from Pilot Edge so we don't need them anymore. Boom, boom, boom. Out go the lights. Uh, BTW, I've watched a lot of your PE test streams, and you seem to have taken most of them in your stride. I'm impressed. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, it, it's uh, it's been one hell of an experience. It's I've learned an awful lot um, from watching all you other PE guys that happen to be on this stream now. Um, watching your videos, uh, it's been very inspiring to watch those videos and how crazy it can be without. I, I'm just not at the level where I can just rely on VOR instruments and stuff. I'm, I'm still a GPS guy for the most part. Um, I'm just not that quick on my feet just yet. Um, I've only been at this for, let's see, I've been on Pilot Edge for two months, two months now. So I got one more I rating to go I11. Uh, I'll probably be practicing that. Um, bum, bum, bum. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe I'll practice it tomorrow. Won't do it for real, but I'll practice it tomorrow because I've never done a. Uh, what is that one? That's a uh, DME arc. So I've never done that, and until uh, my practice two days ago, I never did a back course. Um, and when I practiced that on Thursday, I did not post that to YouTube, but uh, you should be able to watch it on uh, on my channel here. Um, that wasn't too pretty. Because uh, I didn't quite understand how to do the back core stuff uh, until I saw a little BC button on my autopilot, and voila, everything turned properly. I started turning the right way, all that wonderful stuff. So now I can say I can definitely at least fly those. So there's a lot of approaches circling to lands, back courses. And of course, everybody, when I was messing around when I first started flying everyone was flying ILSs so that was those those are fairly easy but all these other weird approaches um, so once I finish my I-11 then uh, I think I'm gonna start uh, learning to fly my caravan uh, I've got the Carnado caravan because uh, I was talking to other people and chit-chatting and forums and blah 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 and I want to start doing FS economy and that seems to be uh, the airplane that is at most locations that should be very, very easy to find and lease and rent and make some money until I can afford to purchase uh, my own. Um, I also have the Turbo Duke, which I love, um, but those are probably a little bit harder to find. Um, and then I love the Cirrus SR-22, but those are probably even harder to find. Thanks for the show. We gave you a follow. I appreciate that. And appreciate the follow, Bing Gamer. Bin Gamer. Bing Gamer. Thank you very much. Welcome aboard and welcome aboard Showtime. I appreciate it. Appreciate everybody coming by. Uh, there you go. There's the follow, Showtime. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, if anybody wants to take a look and see what is behind the magic curtain, which is right there behind the magic curtain here. Look, I can even switch to my GTN 750, which is on my boom, boom, boom. And you can see it there. And behind the magic curtain right there is the, boom. It's the screens that I actually look at. Hey, thanks a lot, Disgrace. I appreciate it. Apparently the caravan is one of the best money makers in FS economy. I use Baron 58 a lot myself. Yeah, that's um, that's what uh, uh, I, I do have the Baron 58. I mean, it came with P3D, so I can certainly fly that. Um, the problem is I use a lot. I, I'm not a VC guy. I, I'm a 2D guy because I have this set up. So it's a little tougher for me to use like the turbine duke doesn't have any vc panels or uh, sorry any 2d panels so i have to put the 3d panel 
where my uh, G1000 is located now. So I I'm trying to get used to that and camera angles and stuff like that. Um, but this is what I see my three screens on triple head to go. Um, the reason why I don't have this up is because it's all washed out and I can't get my camera. No mic. I can't hear you. You can't hear me? Really? Can everybody else hear me okay? Boy, I hope you can hear me. Check your sound. It's working for me fine. Okay, good. Whew. Scared me. That would have been a very, very bad stream if nobody could hear anything. Oh, very bad indeed. Anyways, um, I think that's going to do it for me. I am going to have... I'm going to have a glass of wine is what I'm going to have. And chill out and pop on a movie and see what we got going on. Um, that was fun. The I-10. That was a little nerve-wracking. Learned a couple lessons. Um, one of my biggest mistakes, I guess, was not requesting the leave for the hold early enough so that I can exit it gracefully. So I went a little off course turning and uh, that was not good. Um, anybody who's interested, this is my knee board. Um, and these are the sheets that I printed out and, and used my, for notes and stuff like that. A blank PDF is located if you want to look and grab it for yourself and use it, feel free. Just follow the link on my info box. Um, this is what it actually looks like filled out. As you can see, it's got all my, it's hard to see. It's got all my notes, where I'm going, what I'm cleared for, uh, other notes while I'm in flight, arrivals, blah blah blah. So that's kind of, I kind of like using this. This is like a, a clip where I got 97 cents at Walmart or something like that. Anyways, it was awesome. Okay, well, that's going to do it for me. I appreciate everybody joining, and as usual, you are more than welcome to watch all of my. Uh, all of my streams here and follow me on uh, on YouTube where I'm going to push this stream as soon as we're done. Alright, so we're good. Uh, frequency change is approved. See ya!